You're a self-confessed Madonna superfan. Yes. <laughs> uh, is, she, is she a victim of ageism yeah. and misogyny? Absolutely. And the fact that we're sat here, two men sat here, discuss, three men, discussing misogyny is misogynistic. Why? So Kevin is... Well, men can't because discuss women. You don't get an opinion on whether Madonna is telling her truth or not. Is That's her truth. What, what is her truth? That people are being misogynistic hang towards on, on, her on. and that a woman over All 45 right, just... is not allowed or permitted to be sexy Sorry, there is... in the eyes James, of people like you. There is, only, there is only the truth. There's not people's versions of it. We're not on the Meghan and Harry podcast, right? <laughs> so you can't just say her truth. No, there are facts. The fact is she's done stuff to her face surgically, which means when she goes out now, we all shriek in horror. I right? think it's quite rude to say that you shriek in horror. I literally did. And... It was like a Halloween costume. <laughs> But ultimately, Piers, like you've met Madonna, you you called her rude when you she met was her. incredibly rude every time I met her. But I don't hold that against her. She well, it sounds like you do. No, no, actually, no, no, no. Just don't be wrong. Women no, no. are allowed to be they're they... allowed to be rude little madams, and she is right. No problem at all. No, women I'm... are allowed to not like you, Piers. Absolutely and fine. That doesn't give you permission not to then problem... attack them. James, in of not a problem at all. She can hate my guts. It doesn't mean I can't pass comment on her without being called immediately misogynist. But is anyone discussing how you look and would all you the be time. okay with that? Literally, I get fat shamed all the time, even though, as you can see, I'm basically emaciated, right? <laughs> so, so, and this is a new regime, by the way. It's a new year, new me, and it's all just falling off. Right, so, yeah. um, <laughs> sure. But I, you know why? Because I got fat shamed. I actually think it's good. And Madonna needs to listen to proper friends who say to her, what the hell are you doing to your face, love? Right? Yeah. Look at that. It was like the, the Bride of Wilderstein. It's, it's not misogyny to notice that she looks crazy. I'm a huge Madonna well, fan. Well, it's wrong like, to say that she looks crazy. But she does look crazy. If well, this was my friend, fair. I would looks, be like, ma'am, you look, terrible. You look like a loaf of Warburton's. Like, if she was my friend, seriously. I think the issue here is she is too rich to be looking this crazy. I have no problem with cosmetic surgery. There are loads of celebrities that have had it done. The aim is not to look crazy. I'm a huge fan of her, and I just think she's too... Established, she's too much of an icon to do this to but herself. But what you're missing and then blame here is it that on misogyny. It's what not you're misogyny to notice. Is that she's telling you why, perhaps, in your opinion, she looks the way she looks? Which and is she's crazy. been a victim. It's not crazy. She's not That's a mental crazy. health condition. Joe, even you don't think she's a victim. I do think of she's what? a victim. Of what? Of misogyny, of ageism, of people like you saying she's she not literally... sexy and that she's not permitted to be sexy in her 60s. I didn't well, say she, she wasn't sexy. Well, look, look I just said room. that when someone is that desperate, I mean, she releases yeah. picture after picture yeah. of herself. Naked, lying under beds, you know, yeah. all sorts of kissing toy boys. It's all attention seeking narcissism. Fine. Yeah. What you can't do is look at this picture here. Now, the idea, <laughs> the idea I can't criticize that picture and say that is desperate <laughs> for a woman in the 60s. I mean, I and without that's... you saying you're being ageist and misogynist, <laughs> yeah. no, I'm not, James Barr. Look that's... at her, she's hot. Yeah. That's a hot piece that's... of. That, I mean, that looks like a dead cock No, it, 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 it does not. Imagine if that was your great-grandma, which, by the way, she's old enough to be. It, it looks honestly like a... It, it looks like, it it looks like, like a name. crime scene, doesn't is it? it? That's <laughs> what it does. Yeah, it looks I mean, like it a... Look, look, if that was your, I don't know if your grandparents are still alive. Are uh, no, sadly, my nan is not right, here well, anymore. But imagine if she was and that was her, and she released that picture. I would love that. Really? Yeah, I've got friends whose grandmas are on OnlyFans. Like, get out there. If that, I'd have to have a quiet word, right? I think you'd probably be feeling a little uncomfortable, but mainly because you might be finding it attractive. But here's yeah. my point. I don't think you can behave the way Madonna behaves and not expect criticism. Yeah. To then play yeah, the victim yeah. when you deliberately provoke people, if they, I think it's absurd. It would be like me playing the victim when I give it out large with my opinions and then say... And someone says to me, oh, stop being so disgusting, bitch. Oh, my God, I'm a victim. Oh, don't be ridiculous. Look, look I see a lot of it as embarrassing. I look at Hel Helen Millen, who, Mirren, who I think must be a bit older and is really sexy, yeah. Yeah, in, in, a, in, a, in a very yeah. different way. But some of the criticism she gets is motivated because of her age and because she's because a woman. She wants, because, because she, she gets want, more because she criticism. Wants to play, than she wants to play the 25-year-old sex yeah. part, and yeah. she's 64, right? Mm. And I'm sorry, Esther, but I would say the same about Mick Jagger when he's overdone yeah. it—the old, you know, strolling bone thing on stage. Just like, come on, mate, put it. Uh, and he needs to stop having children. Um, look, <laughs> I, I don't think it's misogyny to notice when someone's acting nuts, right, mm -hmm. or looking ridiculous. I, mean, I, don't I think say, you can say, I say that this she's as nuts. a huge fan of Madonna. She doesn't she is need a bit to do nuts, this. James. Come on. She is, and I like that about. Look, listen. So same person behaves like that. She is Madonna. She is an icon. She will always be an icon. This is completely unnecessary. And it's not ageism or sexism or misogyny to notice that this is unnecessary. But, uh, by the way, know. look, look, Jay, here's the point. You've bought tickets to her concert. Millions of other people have and will. It'll be a smash hit. She's not a victim. She might be many other things. But all this does is fuel this sort of furore around Madonna and she'll make even more Works. money and sell even more no. tickets. But it's just the playing the victim which got my goat this morning. It's like, Madonna, of all things, stick it back to me. Call me a rough old English twerp, whatever you want to call me. A I potato. don't care. I don't <laughs> care. 
but don't play the victim because it's pathetic. I don't think it's pathetic that she's just sold out a world tour of 30 plus dates in seconds. I don't think that's pathetic I think at it's all. absolutely baffling, but if you want to go and watch her prancing around in her 60s, look at like that. Enjoy your show, James. Thank uh, you so much. Good and to in see the you. words of Madonna, there's no greater power than the power of goodbye. Indeed. James, <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> that seems slightly immaterial, girl. Uh, anyway, oh, next... Yeah, yeah. 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 See you uh, on Next to that. <laughs>